de do. Good morning, sunshines. How are y'all this morning? So anyhow, I wanted to make a quick recap of something I spoke about on my podcast probably about a year or so ago. And if you click the link in my bio, it'll take you to my podcast, some of them. Uh, well, well, the ones that I've done as of as of now. So anyhow, one of those podcasts talks about the word no. N-O, no. So for me, I was never one to take no personally because I always was the type of person to think, okay, well, if you tell me no, the next person won't. Or the next person won't. Well, I still have another chance. You know, you're not the end all, be all, or the be all, end all. However, it, however it goes, I've always had the assertion that if someone tells me no, that just gives me a new opportunity. Yeah, no is simply a new opportunity for something different. No to a relationship. Okay, let me go find something new and better. No to a job. Okay. Let me go find something new and better. Uh, no to this car, no to a house, no to whatever. But I also um, think that when we're told no, that is God keeping us from something that he knows is not good for us. God is telling us, hey, no, I don't want you there. I want you there. So I wouldn't take no's. So personally, for me, um, like I said, it's, it's two things that I take into consideration. Being told no gives me the opportunity, a new opportunity to go do something better. And being told no also is God's way of telling you to go do something better. So it's a win-win. Don't be afraid of the word no. Think of it as new opportunities. So, go live your life. Bye. Have a great Thursday.